Hey, MLS listening subscribers, welcome back. We've got another great vendor spotlight here for you. As always, I'm your host, Dave Scalora. And we've got RPR back today. Uh, a little change. Is, I'm going to introduce here uh, Liz, Liz Tewksbury. Liz, how are you doing today? I'm doing great, Dave. Thank you. Yeah. How are you? Uh, doing well, doing well. Thanks. And I know it's your first time. We had RPR, of course, on many times, but it's your first time. You're, you're the Senior Director of Industry Relations for RPR, um, and we're thrilled to have you on. Um, so thanks for coming on. And, you know, I know it's always tough. RPR has got so much. <laughs> there's there's just a ton of material, but you've uh, been gracious enough to kind of narrow it down to maybe a few a few highlights, kind of a, maybe a, the top five kind of things of why you should be using RPR, we'll call it, I guess, um, and uh, to show us here today, right? That is right, Dave. Um, I'm really excited. I'm happy to to be here. And I think that the topics that I chose will really um, help realtors with their day-to-day -day business. Um, and certainly, we're always available to help beyond what I talk about today. Fantastic. Yeah, Easter just passed, but we still we got some Easter eggs here for you. So <laughs> I couldn't resist that cheesy. That's a good uh, one. <laughs> <laughs> so, but uh, yeah, I tell you what, I'm going to turn it over to you, to you, Liz, and let's dive on in. Perfect. I'm going to just share my screen and bring my presentation up so that everybody can see it. Okay. So, um, yeah, again, thanks so much, Dave. I really do appreciate being here. Um, it's a pleasure to, to chat with everybody at MLS Listings always and uh, being able to, to talk about the value that RPR offers to realtors never gets old, in my opinion. So uh, we thank you again for, for allowing us to be here. Thank you. Um, so want to talk about first and foremost, you know, what is RPR? For those of you that are maybe new or that maybe need a reminder about exactly what RPR is, um, we're a national parcel centric database. We have both residential and commercial properties. Um, we are built exclusively for realtors, which means that we do not charge for realtors to access our tool. Um, and then most importantly, what I want to point out is that there is not consumer access into RPR. This is solely for those realtors that are practicing professionals um, in the industry. So um, any data that you see is only available to your fellow realtors. And we do have a very critical mission, we feel, and that is simply to create efficiencies for realtors um, so that they can better serve consumers. Um, our goal is to provide data. Our goal is to provide technology that really helps realtors to be able to demonstrate what their, their market knowledge is, that local market knowledge specifically. And then, of course, we all know how important it is to continue to reinforce our value. That seems to be a common theme in our industry these days. So realtor value is really um, taking taking a top spot. And we think that RPR certainly is doing a great job and is able to help you to provide that value. And then just a little highlight here I thought would be interesting to see how things are going across the country and see what your counterparts are doing. We actually have 354,000 realtors across the country that utilize RPR. Um, those are our 90-day consecutive users and over 17 million engaged sessions in 2023. So lots of great stuff happening. Um, and then, of course, we've got an outstanding net promoter score that we're always really proud of and really happy um, to highlight. Lots of great value proposition for realtors, um, and, and I won't go into reading all of these for you, but you know our, our big goals here are that we help you to build trust, we help you to be able to provide data back to your uh, buyers and your sellers. We really uh, aim to be able to help you understand what the local market trends are and, and, and be efficient in your day-to-day -day business. So lots of great value for realtors. Um, that that help you run your business day to day. And then I wanted to also highlight some of the key areas and also provide a QR code of ways to use RPR. Um, as Dave said earlier, there are so many pieces to the RPR tool that uh, spending time highlighting and digging deep into all of them would be nearly impossible. We'd be here for days. But these are just some of the really key features and the great ways that we see that agents are using RPR day to day. Um, everything from looking at historical listings and public records to our mobile app, uh, FEMA flood maps, it, everywhere across the board, anything and anything, anything and everything you could imagine um, really does live within the RPR product. And we're really pleased with, with being able to offer these tools to all of you. 
So as Dave had said at the beginning, um, we're not going to cover everything, but I do have what I call five wow factors. Um, so just to give you a, a little bit of insight on me, I have been in the real estate industry and in organized real estate for about 14 years, I want to say now, and much like Dave and, and the others at MLS listings, I started off working at an MLS. Um, and it was there that I learned so much about the various products and services that are available to realtors. And one in particular was RPR. And um, I hadn't been working at the MLS um, for the past five years. I was off doing some other things in the industry. So I had sort of forgotten about how valuable and how amazing the RPR tool is. And now that I'm here with the organization and I've taken the time over the last few months to dig in, I've found that there are so many amazing tools that I had either forgotten about or wasn't aware even existed. So that was what I thought I would bring to you today is what I have been blown away in learning um, about RPR in the last couple of years. Nice. There's a there's a lot of wow factors when we deal with RPR. I found having to, done a few of these shows, and um, it's just funny because everything you we put on there is, is you know you mentioned value, right, Liz? And today's today's world we find ourselves in, providing value, showing the value you can provide as an agent, really is is the focal point now. Um, and so these tools are are kind of right in the, the the wheelhouse here of what we're trying to accomplish here. So yeah, absolutely, absolutely. So I'm going to run you through these 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 uh, handful of items. And um, one thing that I tried to do on each is to also provide you with a QR code that you can scan so that you can get additional information um, on that particular area. And I do want to highlight that we have a number of um, upcoming webinars that you'll be able to join live or even watch later on that that dig really deep into these um, specific, you know, again, wow factors that I've, I've uncovered. Um, so first one that I want to get into is our market trends campaign. So this is um, very easy to understand graphs and charts, uh, simple tools to highlight changes um, in the market for your buyers and your sellers. And um, we're really proud of the fact that we have seen tremendous use in the, the market trends reports. Uh, you can see the number up on, on the screen now, you know, almost 1.3 million um, that have used uh, that have, have used the market trends report uh, since February of, of 2023. So I'm going to actually come out of the PowerPoint because what I want to do is, is go live and show you how market trends works. So I took the liberty actually earlier today before I hopped on, I was doing a little bit of playing around and I ran a search um, in San Jose just to get an idea um, and take a look. And the way I did this was just by coming up to this research button and then clicking on residential market trends. Once in here, I entered San Jose and clicked on it. So you can see that there is a tremendous amount of data that comes up in the market trends report. Everything from uh, your median estimated property value, um, new listings, and you can see over here, you can toggle through a number of property types should you wish. The default is single family condo uh, townhouse apartment, um, active listings, just a ton of data. And, you know, we know that there are many agents out there that are seasoned veterans that really um, have no, uh, no struggle with explaining what a market trends report is. But we also know that there are other folks who maybe might need a little bit of support, right, in trying to convey the message that they want to send when they're breaking down the specifics of what's going on in a particular market. And so because we knew that the market trends report was getting so much use, we thought that it would be really great to incorporate AI into the market trends report to really help folks gain um, the ability to either create social media shares or really understand what was going on in that market and be able to explain it well. So if you notice, I'm still in the script in the, the, the market trends report, but I'm going to come over here and just click on create script. Now, when I do that, what's happening is that I'm actually jumping into chat GPT. We have it integrated in on the back end and you here can choose your tone, right? So do you want to come off as very professional or do you want to be engaging or is this a, a more laid back conversational type of communication you're going to be putting out. So I'm just going to choose engaging. And then I can pick 
my audience? Do I want this to be geared just towards buyers, just towards sellers, or towards both? So we'll just keep both. And then I get to decide, do I want to create a video script? Perhaps you're somebody that really wants to, to take off using TikTok um, and you know, you're struggling what, with what you should say in your message. We'll create that video script for you. Maybe you're trying to build your brand and you want help with a social campaign. Or maybe, like I said earlier, analyzing metric, metrics just is not your strong suit and you want some help with understanding how to really convey that message back to the, your buyers and sellers. We can help you with that. So I clicked analyze metrics and you can see it is just simply generating the script that I should use to analyze what those metrics are. Now I can do a couple of different things here. I can copy that text and use it wherever I see fit or I can send it to myself by email. Furthermore, I can just come over and jump in and say, you know what, let's actually make that into a social campaign that I can use on my Facebook or my LinkedIn. Again, it's going to generate that script. And now you've got a really great social media campaign. And again, maybe you want to copy it and just paste it. Or maybe you're someone that says, email it to my assistant and she's going to get that out the door. Um, and, that, and then we can it'll get into your inbox for you and you can get those social media shares sent out. So really, really great opportunity with the market script writer, something that we're, we're very proud of and we find um, is being utilized to its full capacity. Um, as you can see here, 115,000 times that wow. folks have gone in and used that AI script writer since we launched it last June. Oh, wow. That's fantastic. And it is, you know, for those that are maybe a little skeptical of AI or are not comfortable, it's super easy to use. I mean, you see how tone, right, and audience, and you're off and running. Um, and just great way to add content, to get content up there on social media or whatever you need for the for the week with just a, a quick click or two, right? So um, it's, it's one of my favorites. I use it daily. <laughs> uh, I think it's yeah. really great, too. And to your point, Dave, you know, for those that are, are maybe struggling with taking that first step into using AI to help to uh, help them in their business. This is a really good first step into that world. Definitely. Yeah. And there is a QR code up on the screen right now. You can uh, take a photo of that. You'll see it links to all of the information we have on our blog related to AI. And you'll also be able to access upcoming webinars um, that are available on the blog as well under the learning center on this particular area. Um, again, just some additional information about the market trend script writer, you know, that engagement boost, brand enhancement and understanding um, of the market. But one thing I wanted to kind of speaking of Easter eggs, Dave, is uh, is drop you a little Easter egg here. And that is coming this month, April 2024. We've taken AI script writer one step forward. This is going to launch soon and it is our commercial script writer. So very similar to what you see in that trends report, but we made some changes to it to accommodate our commercial folks. And um, again, choosing your tone in your audience, but now you're gonna choose the data points and then also very versatile formats in which your, uh, your script will be, whether that be presentations for outlines and pitches or just quick one pages, uh, lots of good stuff coming. Uh, we're continuing to grow and that AI train has taken off and we're on it. That's awesome. That's awesome, though. Thank you, Liz. And you know, say, hey, you got to come to my show for these uh, breaking news, right? Right, breaking <laughs> right, yeah. news. <laughs> Good stuff. Awesome. Awesome. Um, so my next wow factor, um, you know, this one has been around in RPR for years and years and years. I remember way back when I first uh, learned about what RPR was um, and seeing the mailing labels. Um, so where you can create your farming and prospecting lists and print up to 2,000 mailing labels per month. Um, it's great stuff. So we're gonna go live into our PR and actually take a look at what the mailing label creation process looks like. So I just entered in the zip code to Manchester, New Hampshire, which is um, where I live. And I'm actually going to click public records instead of the for sale and for lease. And I'm gonna click search. Now you can see that there was too many results. So I'm gonna just close right out of there. And now I'm going to um, hone in on a, a specific area. So I'm selecting intermediate neighborhoods. And I'm gonna say search in this area. And now you can see 
all of the properties, the public record information that is available came up in that specific area that I was looking for. Now, this is so simple, so easy. Click on mailing labels. And all you do is look, do you want to do an export in a CSV file? Or would you like to create specific mailing labels? You just put them into your printer and you come down and print. Now, what's great is that, see, we have eliminate duplicates checked off. So that is gone. And now here you can decide whether you want it to go to the owner um, or the current resident. You also can decide if, if you want it to go to an absentee owner. Lots of great um, options that are here for you. And then you simply can just either save that CSV file or print it out. You get up to 2,000 mailing labels per month. And it's such a great way for you to really hone in on a certain neighborhood, especially, as you know, if we've got buyers that are looking in a specific neighborhood, you can go in there and, and send out a mailing saying, hey, we have buyers. Um, are you thinking about selling? If so, why don't you contact me? Great resource, simple, easy to use, and a great way for you to work on your prospecting. So yeah, like you said earlier, it's all nowadays. It's all about hyper local, right? And and you know, no one's doing county more. It's gone down to zip to even to, to neighborhoods. And so, it's nice to be able to get all that data so quickly and get yeah. into a neighborhood just with a click of a button. And so, um, yeah, very nice. And again, nice QR code for you takes you to some videos about mailing labels and other collateral that we have for you. And um, again, great webinars on this same subject. And, and I just love that, you know, right now we've covered something as simple as, as you know, back going back to your prospecting. And then now we've covered AI as well. So we're on all different ends of, of the right. technology okay. spectrum here, um, but all important stuff that's valuable to realtors. So RPR Mobile, um, we're really, really proud of, of this tool. It, it got a complete overhaul and it really is quite amazing. Um, we have a QR code up on the, the screen for you where you can scan and actually download the RPR app. Uh, it's very similar to what you're used to at RPR uh, uh, you know, on the desktop. Instant access to property data, that powerful search um, it does it does have the ability to know your location and you can click on what's near you, right? So if you happen to be um, standing in front of a property when you're out for a walk and you want to get some information on it that because it's for sale, you can easily see where you are and get some information on that property. Great customized reports. Um, and, and again, um, you know, got a complete overhaul and we're really proud of of uh, of the tool. And again, Right here, it shows where you can download, um, have access to the shareable market trends, everything and anything you could imagine is an RPR mobile. So we we definitely recommend that you download and uh, get it on your phone and make sure that you're logging in and taking advantage when you're out on the road. Oh, yeah. It, you know, and, and you really should have at least, you know, two mobiles, I always tell, because you always have a, at least if you're maybe you're comfortable with one, get up, have a backup at the very at the very worst. And the nice thing about uh, Liz is it's synced up. Right. So, you yes. know, when you're when you're on the making, maybe you're out on the out there and you're making notes at a property about maybe the, the master bedroom closet or something that gets synced up right to that that client or that agent's desktop. Nobody else sees it, but they'll see it. Right. Um, and right. vice versa. Right. So that's right. a really cool feature. Yeah, it, it really is. And um, we find that folks are using it more and more as they're out on the road, especially when they're at a property and they, you know, that the, the customer might say to them or their, their, their uh, client might say to them, you know, how many square feet does this have again? And they maybe right. don't have the listing sheet with them while well, they've got their phone with them. We know that. And they're always able to, to pull that up and find out all the information about the property in real time um, as they're, as they're there trying to get that sale made. Right. All righty. Again, more information here. So broker tools. Uh, broker tools, I, um, I think it's just a really, really cool way for brokers to be able to show their value, right? So this is, I guess, what you would refer to as white labeling within the RPR tool. So this is open to brokers that they can um, contact us. The information is right here, blog.narrpr.com slash enroll. And um, it, the enrollment process is very quick. And what it does is allows for the broker to brand the RPR experience um, to their brokerage. So the logo will display on reports. Um, there are company custom pages. You'll see that there's a broker AVM widget, which is great. 
um, deep links that are available to them. Really great stuff to, to, again, show not only the realtor value, but now the broker value. Um, to date, we've got over 10,000 companies that have enrolled in the broker tools across the country. And that means that the agents within that brokerage see that branding as well. And that's up over you know 688,000 uh, agents that are seeing their broker branding within the RPR tool. Nice. Yes. And again, uh, this is just more information on uh, broker the the broker tools really empowering your strategy and uh just you know showing your brand within the product yeah 2024 it's, it's really going to be about uh right going out there showing your value um yeah. and it's great liz that you guys have so many tools to take advantage of to go ahead and do to do just that so uh amazing stuff <laughs> yeah and then the last thing that i wanted to share is that one of the things that we are most proud of is our learning page. We, in my opinion, just do such an exceptional job with not only offering webinars on individual subjects, um, but then RPR as a whole. But on top of that, we've got on-demand videos so that you can watch at, at your leisure, or perhaps you just want to know something really quick. You can go into the, the learning hub, you can click off CMA, you'll get a quick two, three minute tutorial on how to run a CMA within RPR. So many great tools, printouts, eBooks, anything and everything that you can imagine on top of our national webinars, which are, are are just amazing. Our our training team does such a great job with them and really helping realtors uh, take advantage and use RPR, you know, to, to, to the most that they can. I included an, a QR code there as well. I love these QR codes because you could scan and land exactly where you right. need to. This brings you right to our learning hub where you can find all the upcoming webinars, et cetera, um, to be able to help you in your RPR journey. Yeah, honestly, uh, the, what I love about the you the learning the learning hub is when you're actually on the RPR site, and let's say you're you're just kind of going through navigating through a certain section, you know, whatever page you're on, when you hit that learn button, it knows you're on that page, is and here's here's how to use that page, right? So you don't got really have to go far to go looking. You just just hit the button and, and you can have it right there. And you and you all are nice enough to let us. We we put um you know your trainings on our calendar. Um, and so I encourage, you know, everybody to, we've done, Liz, you've done a great job of kind of high level, Hey, here's all these benefits. So for you, for all our agents out there, right. Take advantage and really kind of dive into more nuts and bolts with these trainers. It's, it's RPR's trainers, right? Um, they're the RPR experts trainers, on it. They're, and they're amazing. I, I, I join their webinars all the time and, you know, it's funny, I have two screens and so I'll be doing my work here and I'm listening to them over there and I learn something every single time I hop on and listen, they do a tremendous job. They really do. But I will tell you this, if you get stuck and you're in a, in a little bit of a pickle, this is our customer support uh, information. We offer 24 seven customer support, 365 days a year. We've got a call center located in Omaha, Nebraska. So you're never alone. There's always somebody from RPR that is there to help, um, whatever the case may be. So Liz, I can't thank you enough for coming on um, and showing all, all, all of these great things and how they like, really provide value. So easy to use RPR, I can tell you. And for our agents, go in there, take the trainings. We have them up there, right? You guys are nice enough to let us link your trainings up. Those are RPR trainers on there. Um, and uh, you got to come back, Liz. To, to, I think we've got a, I mean, we did some great stuff here, but I know we need more on RPR Mobile. And, and to be honest, we could have probably done 15 Easter eggs, uh, but we'd be here, like you said, a few hours. So um, I'm sure we're going to have you back on as soon as possible. And we're looking forward to some great things in 2024. Well, thank you so much, Dave. It was my pleasure to be here. And I absolutely would love another opportunity to come take an even deeper dive into all of the great tools that RPR has. Fantastic. Liz, thanks so much. And uh, for all our agents out there, thanks for tuning in and uh, keep an eye out because we're going to have Liz back soon enough uh, to talk about more great product offerings from, from our PR. Thanks, everybody. Make sure to check out our pro support page for additional videos on a full range of topics. And don't forget to click that subscribe button on our MLS listings YouTube page.